Hey, how's it going everyone? My name is Fern Sakari and welcome to my LS Video Fart tutorial how to fix texture loss and draw distance up installing fix it packs. Please mod at your own risk. I will not be held responsible for any damage to your PC. Back up your game files and keep a clean copy of GTA 5. For requirements, you're going to need a copy of GTA 5 when IV game config, a pack file and heap adjuster, and script hook v. Main downloads, we are going to be installing the higher and lower increased LOD draw distance mod by Timmy Luke Gaming. We're also going to be installing the no bright taxi bus or metro lights, and we're also going to be installing my recommended LSPDFR settings for better performance and texture loss. Go ahead and close out of that. Go ahead and start here. Right here, we have our main game directory to our left, and over here to our right, we have our open IV. Let's go ahead and start with our main game directory. We're just going to go ahead and install my custom INI settings for better performance and texture loss. What you need to do here is go ahead and go down here. Go ahead and go down here. You're going to select, you're going to go right here to your folder. It says LSPDFR. Go ahead and open it up. We're replacing this one right here, the LSPDFR INI. I, I, I would recommend backing up this one here before installing mine. All right, go ahead and open up with WinRAR. You're just going to take the INI folder, or excuse me, the INI file and drag it into your uh, LSPDFR folder and drop go ahead and hit replace go ahead and close out of the WinRAR go ahead and open up the file I'll quickly go over a few things that we changed here all right, right here sorry about that I was reading something our main our main uh, preload all models we have this set defaults we also changed our call out multiplier to 200 what this means is the so the lower this number is the lesser call outs you're going to get the higher this number is the the more frequently uh call outs are going to come in from dispatch we changed our world events uh max number of events down to zero we also changed the uh cops can commandeer vehicles we changed this to false what this means is if a cop if a police officer loses their pursuit vehicle or loses their uh their police vehicle they will, if you, this is set to true they will try to accommodate a, a civilian vehicle so if you set this to false with this this will stop them from trying to steal civilian vehicles to continue this pr pursuit all right we also changed our disabled player flashlight override to true i'm going to scroll down here you hear what else did we change here oh we changed the ambient spawn disable random units we changed that to uh true we also lowered the uh spawn max cops in the area we lowered that down to five we also disabled the big radar and right down here this is the most important one the police station disable ambient spawn so the police station disable ambient spawn these are the police officers that are standing in front of the police station that you always see out there talking and smoking if you change this to true it's going to remove all those police officers uh standing out in front of the uh, police station and believe it or not this will save you on a lot of texture issues depending on if you're using notepad or notepad plus plus make sure to save your file please follow the uh, pathways when they show up on the screen First thing we're going to do here is we're going to back up our vehicle's meta. So let's go down to my favorites. We're going to open up the vehicle's meta. Go right down here. You're going to highlight the vehicle's meta. You're going to right click. You're going to go down here to extract. Just go up here. Just go ahead and select desktop. Don't worry about selecting a folder. Go down here and select. Go ahead and select folder. Then it's going to pop up right here on your desktop. Next thing you're going to do here is we are going to go back up here and we're going to go ahead and select GTA 5. Go back up here to mods. Now what we're going to do here is we are going to re remove some high. Of some high textures and i'll show you a little tip here we're going to go down here to time 64e go to open it up next you're going to go to levels next you're going to go to gta 5 go down here to vehicles go to open it up so right here these are all your vehicles that you see driving around lspdfr inside your gta 5 so what we're going to do here is we are going to eliminate some of the high texture anything with the plus high on it the plus high symbol is your high textures like stuff that has to do with like 4k or real high definition textures we're going to remove some of those because the goal here is that we want to remove most of these from our vehicles this way the game will be able to focus on the higher textures on the buildings and billboards and all that kind of stuff the your surroundings we're going to eliminate some of the stuff from the vehicles don't worry your vehicles will all still be there you won't i promise you, you won't even notice it especially if you have any graphic mods installed or even just lsp or excuse me just gta 5 and stuff i promise you you'll, you'll barely even notice it let's go ahead and go up here to our search and we're just simply going to hold down our left shift key we're going to select the plus sign like so and now what we're going to do here is as you can see or see all, all these ones here that say plus high these are all it right here we're simply going to highlight hold down your left control key go to select a for all and you're going to right click and you're simply going to select delete but there we go now we have those out of the way now just in case your uh no more bright taxi uh got removed because they're in the exact same file that type 6040 we're going to go ahead and reinstall your uh bright uh no more bright uh taxi lights and train and bus lights we're going to go ahead and open up the WinRAR. We're going to go ahead and stay right here to in Type 64E. We're going to go up here to our search. We're going to type in Taxi. Like so. We're going to go right here to the Taxi YTD. Go ahead and open it up. We're going to open up our folder here the uh, in our WinRAR for Taxi 2. Go ahead and take the DDS file, drag it over, and drop. Go ahead and go back over to your WinRAR. Now you're going to grab the Taxi Sign 2. 
go to take it drag it over and drop make sure to click ok and save all right now we're going to go and take care of the uh let's see which one do we have here next the metro train so real simple you're just going to go back up to your search you're just going to type in metro there it is right there let's go ahead and open it up we're going to go ahead and grab our metro train one get over and drop now go back up here to your search and you're simply just going to type in bus so the first one we're going to do here is the metro bus so all you're going to do here is you're just going to go down to this one right here that says bus ytd go ahead and open it up go ahead and grab the metro bus uh, image drag it over and drop just look for the one that says airbus go ahead and open it up going to take the airbus one drag it over and drop we're going to go back down here to our vehicles meta remember that we have our one that we backed up over there let me go ahead and close out of this uh winrar there go ahead and open up the uh, winrar here the one that we are going to test it out with is going to be this one right here but for this one we're going to be installing the lower increased invisible modded cars wheels from the distance lod's fixed plus no more hinted police emergency vehicles emergency lights sorry a lot, lot to process there all right so what we're getting so this the reason why we have our backup one is in case this one doesn't work for you you can test it out with some of the other ones let's go ahead and open it up we're simply going to do is take this vehicle's meta drag it over to our open iv and drop but and close out of that we can go ahead and close out of our make sure to restart your pc and then i'll see you all site lspdfr and we will test out the draw distance and texture issues my friends, we're here inside our LSPDFR game. We're going to go ahead and test out our draw, draw distance. We'll full, we're first going to test it out by calling us some backup, and then we're going to go ahead and try to do a pursuit out here. 13, can I get an officer to my location? Acknowledged. One, Adam, 13, proceed with patrol. Jesus Christ, dispatch. 13, can I get a second officer to my location? I'm going to be postal marker 3001. Oh, 13 can i get a second unit to my area we're going to be at postal marker 3001 fire truck i didn't need a fire truck but the chili is mountain state wilderness all right we're going to go ahead and try to activate it oh 48 on great ocean highway oh, 13 i can take that Roger that, we're on our way. Here we go. Almost there. Coming through, coming through. I need to check if I clear the way, see if I still have clear the way. Got to remove my motor units. I hate the uh, motor unit. Oh, 13, go to show me in pursuit. Control, can you roll me a second unit, code 3? Hey, dispatch. Go ahead and one three. Go ahead and roll me a second unit, code three. Assistance needed on Great Ocean Highway. Go ahead and one three. Go ahead and start in Delta One. Dispatch has been sleeping lately. Go ahead and one three. Can we get Delta One out here? By the way, if you're wondering, right now I am running my movie night preset. If you don't know anything about that, I recently did a uh, graphic mods tutorial that turned out better than I thought. Make sure to go check that out. I will leave a link down in the description. Also, make sure to go check out my boy Jeffrey Gamer. He recently did a, uh, a pursuit video, a patrol video, excuse me, on an LSPDFR uh, showing off uh, some of my new uh, graphic mods. Make sure to go check that out. Well, item 13 requesting a second unit, code 3. We're giving you nearest postal marker 3031. Backup needed on Sonora Freeway. 
Let me get the uh, Rangers out here. I think that's them up there. Let's go to take the lead up here. My Rangers? Nope. Swing. Either way, we can. Oh, it is the Rangers. Oh, sweet. There we go. At least now we know that our draw distance is working really good. Oh, hey, hey. Oh, damn. He tipped him over. Oh, shit. All right. Alright, three. I'm going to be closing nearest postal marker P025 out, out at the highway. Okay, let's go ahead and stop traffic. We're going to be nearest postal marker 2025. Hell, did, did he take off running? Oh, there he is. <laughs> Didn't realize he got out the vehicle. Look at, oh my gosh, he's not wearing any pants. This is really happening. All right, well, here we go. Or I suggest you stop, whether it's going to get tased. All right, well, it's going to happen. Oh, Jesus. What happens when you get old? You can't see anything. There go. Stay the fuck down, man. What the fuck is your shirt at? Oh, 13, I need to close the highway. Oh, uh, dispatch, what is going on with my... Check my, uh, thing. You guys wonder what I'm talking about. I have to, like I said, I have to check my grammar, please. And see what's, uh... Might be just saying it wrong. One three, I will be closing highway marker 2025. Requesting traffic control near Santiago Mountain Range. Suspect heading north on foot and grapeseed. Gunny, I'm got a gun. But we'll let these rangers take care of them. They're officially done. 13, you can go ahead and clear my column to be heading home for the night. So that brings us to the end of our tutorial. If you enjoyed this uh, video, and hopefully it helped you out with your uh, texture issues and draw distance. Not much I can really uh, go over as far as like making sure that it works correctly. That's the best way I can show you is uh, while I was in a uh, pursuit, it was mainly happening with these uh, Ranger vehicles and some of the uh, police vehicles. So it looked like when the Ranger vehicles uh, showed up, like everything uh, looked like everything went, went correctly. And make sure to go check out Jeffrey Gamer's uh, new pro video. It's I love watching him uh, interact, uh, doing his uh, role play on the LSPDFR videos. He, he always makes them look really fun. And be sure to check out those graphic mods. You know, I think you all really will enjoy those. We have a person with a firearm, a suspect resisting arrest on Grapeseed Main Street. But Adam, one three, I'm going to be heading home for the night. Roger, one, Adam, thirteen.